Mariners hosting the Rays, and the Rays are plus 105. The Mariners are minus 125. The over-under is seven runs. Tampa getting a run and a half is minus 200, meaning if they win the game outright, you win. If they only lose by one, you win. Seattle laying a run and a half is plus 170, meaning if you bet them that way, they have to win. They have to win the game by two. Fleming pitched once against Seattle. They lost that game eight to four. He went two innings, no runs, no earned. And Gilbert pitched in that same game, five and two thirds, no runs, no earned. They won that game eight to four. Tampa's on a four game winning streak. Seattle's on a four game losing streak. Head to head, Tampa's on a three game winning streak against the Mariners. Seattle is six and four against them in their past 10. The team getting a run and a half is nine and one, and the over is four, four and two. I'm going to take the Mariners with the money line. I'll take C uh, Tampa Bay with the runs, and I'm going to go over only because of how well Gilbert has already pitched against the Rays and how well he's pitching right now. I think that he could end losing streak. Let's see if I'm right. Let's see if I'm wrong.